Let's take a live look over Port Washington. Good morning, Port Washington. As you wake up and get going and step outside the door, many of you are going to feel pretty warm air. I didn't I didn't even grab yeah. a coat this morning, Brian, but you said closer to the lake. Things are cooling off a bit. Yeah, it is a little bit cooler right here along the lake shore, and that's where we are, Andrea. We're in Veterans Park here. I can see it's a little bit hazy. I noticed the thermometer on the car go down uh, at least 12 degrees from here to the Marquette Interchange. It was like 70 degrees at the Marquette Interchange, and we're sitting in the upper 50s here right along the lake. But let's take a look at yesterday's high temperatures. Incredible. Tied the record high in Milwaukee at 86 degrees. That was in the morning at like 9 o'clock in the morning. And then the lake breeze kicked in and we were cooler for much of the afternoon yesterday. All right, let's take a look here at temperatures across southeastern Wisconsin right now. Looks like my, my graphics computer is held up. If we could take graphics full, I got to run over to the laptop. And uh, again, we're going to look for uh, temperatures uh, to be. Looks like I'm going to run out of room here. Uh, I'll be right back. <laughs> Okay, I'm back. Had to run over the truck. All right, here we go. We should be able to advance the graphic now. It's one of those things where that laptop gets hung up. All right, visibility across the area. Seven miles in West Bend, seven miles in Waukesha. We're going to keep an eye on a little bit of fog, potentially this morning lakeside. But as of right now, I can tell the visibility down here is just fine. Uh, storm chaser stats this morning with the chaser. Uh, that hasn't been updated either. We got temperatures in the 50s right now. It's 63 in West Bend, 66 in Waukesha, 70 right now in Kenosha. The current dew points right now in the 60s, which is humid. A little refresher here, dew points in the 60s. It, you can feel it. 70s is when it starts to get uncomfortable. We had that yesterday afternoon and I do think at times we'll see that again this afternoon. Weather headlines, more warmth, humid at times in the end of week. We could see some thunderstorms. Cluster of storms just clipped the north end of Sheboygan. Now out over Lake Michigan and over towards Manitowoc this morning. I think that is pretty much wrapping up for you folks in Sheboygan. The rest of us not dealing with anything. Look at all the storms, though, across South Dakota and North Dakota. Those will stay to the west for today. Future forecasts, we go through our day today. Lots of sunshine, a south breeze, south-southeast breeze, maybe a little bit cooler right along the lakeshore. Friday is going to be dry for the most part. Eventually Friday afternoon, that's when we could see a few showers and storms but this computer model fizzles it out before reaching us. So I'd give it maybe a 50% chance at best late Friday for some storms. Today, all the storms out west. Tomorrow, slight risk, level 2 of 5 for severe weather. Your forecast for today, 82 for your high. Inland, 87, mostly sunny, fog, lakeside. For tonight, 62, patchy fog, lakeside, mainly clear and muggy. Here's your 7-day chance of storms late, 82. Saturday, scattered storms, 78. Chance of a shower on Sunday, 70, and a slight chance of showers on Monday, 67 degrees. Cooling back to more spring weather next week.